Within the huge network of iron produced in the Chugoku Mountains and distributed in the Seto Inland Sea, Tomo has played a significant role. The Chugoku Mountains are a region in which the iron production prospered by the method of melting iron sand fueled by charcoal. The iron produced underwent the Okaji and Kokaji blacksmithing processes, becoming iron for knives and was distributed as an important commodity. The transportation of iron was carried out by ships moving through rivers, waterways, and seas to reach the necessary locations. Tomo, facing the Seto Inland Sea, became a significant position as a hub for the accumulation and distribution of iron. In Tomo, a group of blacksmiths was formed with its root in swordsmithing from the Nara period. Since then, Tomo has been popular as a port city with the special technique of producing secondary or finished products made from iron. It is said that there have been blacksmiths in Tomo since the Nara period. Even in ancient times, there were probably swordsmiths and groups of sword craftsmen in Tomo. Unfortunately, there are no remaining artifacts from the Nara and Heian periods, but exceptional wakizashi swords have survived from the early Muromachi period. Engraved on the nakago, the iron part of the handle is the name Bingo Tomonotsu Yabushita Asazo. The Sengoku period and the Middle Ages were times of conflict, but in peacetime during the Edo period, the need for swords diminished. As weapons became less necessary, blacksmiths shifted their activities to ship-related blacksmithing, such as ship nails and anchors. Following that, the total amount of iron production in Tomo became the highest in Japan. They gathered various materials, processed them in the port city, and sold them nationwide. I believe that the origin of such manufacturing is in Tomo which is said to be a city of manufacturing in Bingo province, and its foundation was built on Tomo blacksmithing. This tradition of iron production has been passed down to the present, and companies which are rooted in Tomo blacksmithing have been producing world-renowned products. In recognition of their value as cultural assets, 567 tools and products made by Tomo Blacksmithing were registered as National Tangible Folk Cultural Properties on March 11, 2021. The blacksmithing techniques initiated in Tomo are nationally renowned, highly prized as cultural preservation. Since the establishment of Nippon Steel Fukuyama Works in 1965, and the formation of the Tomo Steel Industry Complex in 1968, the culture of iron processing developed in Tomo has played a central role in Fukuyama's history as a city of iron.